the reason we started the Associated Industries Bright Promise Scholarship Program. Um, there are many reasons. Today I'm still involved with the university to a degree. Uh, I serve on some of the things here and a number of my friends went to school here, uh, business associates. Uh, through our scholarship program I've met more students here and that's not an untypical experience of students that attend Eastern and I think that's a differentiator. The other part of it is that I represent a, a small business organization. My association, our focus is on small businesses across the state. Currently we have about a thousand small businesses throughout the state and I think oftentimes people underappreciate the contributions that businesses make and so I felt that for a business organization to be involved in education was a good thing. Uh, it was a way that our members could contribute back to this community and so we included a personal statement. We also emphasized non-traditional students, those students who maybe have uh, for one reason or another have uh, either not continued their education after high school or they had other things that came up and want to, to increase their education to, in, to enhance their employment opportunities. And so we give a special emphasis to that as well. And it's been a gratifying program. This is now our sixth year. We're right in the process now. We're, we're reviewing applications currently. Uh, and we've, uh, it's been a really a great, gratifying experience. My name is Colleen Harbick. I'm an Eastern Washington University student and I was awarded the Associated in Industries Bright Promise Scholarship. The Bright Promise Scholarship, um, it's number one has made me not realize that I'm going to be paying student loans until you know the end of my life. But, um, it's actually kept me in school instead of going out and finding a couple of low paying jobs you know, and putting off school further than I already have. And being a single parent and working a part-time job and trying to do everything and taking my house and go to school, um, there's been times where money's been, well, it's always been really tight. And without a scholarship, you know, I'd still be working full-time at low-paying jobs, trying to make ends meet and would never be able to get ahead and be supportive of my family and back to the community. It's very important for alumni of Eastern Washington University to give back to members of the community that want an education as well and other students who may not have that privilege or that any way of going to college otherwise. I think there's a lot of people that could benefit from an education and as a way to find success in life. And I think it's important for us that we're given opportunity like scholarships and grants and everything else has been given to give back into that. My greatest accomplishment is having three kids that are successful and responsible and seem happy in their lives. That's been something I've been pushing for while working full time and now getting my education. You know, they've always been at the forefront, my number one priority. And seeing them all happy and doing well, um, that's I think my greatest accomplishment. <laughs> and now getting a college education and being able to have money to go visit with them and you know, spend more time with them and do things with them, I think will be wonderful. <laughs>